No matter what the season, there's always something going on at the Farm Institute of Martha's Vineyard. Easily recognizable by its two giant blue silos, the Farm Institute sits on more than 160 acres of rolling pasture land from the old Katama Farm near South Beach. Hi, I'm Guinevere Kramer with Point B Realty and talk about an experience for your vineyard bucket list. Not only is the Farm Institute a real working farm with animals, a barnyard, farmers, gardens, and greenhouses, but it's really all about bringing farm-based education and engaging first-hand farm experiences to locals and visitors alike. Whether it's the popular kids' summer camp, after-school programs, or a little farm-to-table local food stop at the farm stand, there's something for everyone year-round. And she's, yep, yeah, she's gonna try nibbling on your fingers because she, uh, she's hungry. She's hungry. Today's Farm Institute treat, newborn baby lambs. Lots and lots of baby lambs, some only a couple days old. They're so cute. It's no surprise that they've been very popular and even have special visiting hours here in the barn nursery. Depending on the season, the baby lambs and the large flock of adult sheep are just a few of the many farm animals you'll see or interact with here. There are chickens, goats, pigs, rabbits, turkeys, and a good-sized herd of cows, including the distinctive black and white belted Galloways. From its beginning, the Farm Institute has been an evolving collaboration of conservationists, farmers, and the town of Edgartown. It's now part of the Trustees of Reservations, the largest conservation and land preservation group in Massachusetts. Martha's Vineyard is blessed to have a rich farm history with strong agricultural roots and nowhere is that more evident and accessible today than at the Farm Institute. If you've never been, or if you're like me who's been dozens of times with the kids, the Farm Institute is a classic vineyard experience that's sure to make your bucket list more than once. For Point B Realty, I'm Guinevere Kramer.